वेलकम बैक टू द जावा प्रोग्रामिंग सीरीज एंड टुडे वी विल अंडरस्टैंड हाउ टू राइट डाउन द प्रोग्राम टू प्रिंट नंबर फ्रॉम 1 टू 50 व्हिच इज डिविजिबल बाय 5 और 3 सो आई वांट टू प्रिंट ऑल द नंबर्स फ्रॉम 1 टू 50 व्हिच इज डिविजिबल बाय 5 और 3 सो आवर आउटपुट शुड बी 3 बिकॉज़ इट्स डिविजिबल बाय 3 5 इट्स डिविजिबल बाय 5 6 अगेन इट्स डिविजिबल बाय 3 9 अगेन इट्स डिविजिबल बाय 3 10 again it's divisible by 5 so we just have to keep continuing so we have to print all the numbers from 1 to 50 which is divisible by 5 or 3 so try to pause the video and try to think how can we solve this program so before we jump into the program let's try to analyze the program definition so we have to print some number from 1 to 50 right so first of all let's try to print the number from 1 to 50 So we know that how to print the number from one to fifty. We just have to execute the for loop. So I can just write down the for loop starting from integer i is equal to one, i less than or equal to fifty, and i plus plus. And if I'll try to print the value of i, it will print the number from one to fifty. Perfect. If you are not clear how to print one to fifty using this for loop. then please check out my previous video because it's very important to understand the working of this for loop how to print 1 to 50 using the for loop so now we are printing 1 to 50 and this statement is responsible to print something into the console right so now we have to put some restriction we have to add the restriction that if the i is divisible by 5 or 3 then and then we have to print that number so we have to add the filters right we have to add some condition and we know that whenever we have to add the condition we are using the if statement so i will just try to write down the if statement so i can just write if some condition opening curly bracket and closing curly bracket so i am just writing this statement inside some condition now we just have to focus on the condition what will be our condition so we have to print the number which is divisible by 5 so how can we check divisibility in java so we have a modulo operator right so i can just write down if my number which is i is divisible by 5 that means if i modulo 5 is equal to is equal to 0 then it will just print all the numbers which is divisible by 5 right so if i'll just run this program then it will print all the numbers which is divisible by 5 but we also have to add one more condition I have to print all the numbers which is divisible by three as well. So can we just write the second condition? And I can just write down if i modulo three is equal to is equal to zero, then also print that i as well. Okay. So just try to pause the video and try to look at this program. Is it correct or not? So definitely this program is not correct because this will print fifteen, forty-five, and thirty two times. You can see fifteen two times. 32 times 45 2 times why because 45 is divisible by 5 as well as divisible by 3 so here also it will print 45 and here also it will print 45 right so we don't have to write down this way we just have to write down the or okay so we have to combine the condition we have a two condition and we clearly can see that we have to use or condition right so i can just write down if our i is divisible by 5 or it's divisible by 3 then we just have to print the value of i so we are first generating the 50 numbers and then we are applying some filters right based on the filter given in the program definition we are applying the condition and then we are printing the value now if i'll run this program it will just print our desired output perfect so i hope you are clear now how to write down the program to print number from 1 to 50 which is divisible by any number right so you can just use any number divisible by 6 divisible by 10 okay so that's it for today's video i hope you enjoyed it if you have any comments regarding this video try to write down into the comment section thanks everyone and we'll see you into the next video